Salve rapaziada, beleza? Aqui é o Mike trazendo mais um vídeo pro canal Dessa vez continuação de Call of Juarez, beleza? Vamos juntos Então onde você vai depois de Lincoln? México Até eu percebi que ninguém estava procurando por mim I ended up taking a job at the Rurales. The Mexican Rurales? I was hired to help them track down the cowboys. Cowboys. The most vicious outlaw gang in Cochise County? Curly Bill Brocious, Johnny Ringo? Led by old man Clan himself. They must have paid you a pretty penny to take them hombres on. Not really. But truth be told, I had my own reasons for going after those boys. É. Uma bala pro velhote. Pô, esse jogo tem tudo de Red Dead, mano. So was the bastard you were after now riding with the cowboys? Roscoe Bob Bryant was his name. Oh. But no, this time it was a different bastard I was after. The aforementioned Mr. Ringo. And yes, he was working for old man Clanton. Came upon them robbing a stagecoach, which wasn't surprising, being they were such murderous thieves and bastards. The bandits wore red scarves, so I knew they were the old man. Over there! Hey! I did my best to help those poor passengers. Later, the attackers were dead, and I checked the stagecoach to see how many passengers were still breathing. None. It was then I wondered if the rocks weren't hiding more bandits. Was that all of them, or did I just hit the rear guard? I quickly got my answer. They attacked from on high like Apache often did. They would appear in great numbers from above and rain down lead on their hapless enemy's heads. Making use of the high ground and whatever else they had. Yep, the Apaches always appeared out of nowhere, and there never seemed to be an end to them. Hold on, were you attacked by Apaches? Caraca, tá vindo vagabundo pra caramba! Did I say they were Apaches? I said Clanton's cowboys attacked me Apache style. I was in a pitched battle, but I was holding my own against an overwhelming enemy force. Não entendi agora, velho. Pô, o, o jogo me tirou da minha posição. Entendi não. I was still pretty green and would often blunder into regrettable situations. But I just kept shooting at anything I could see up in those damn rocks. I didn't see Ringo, but I knew he was with the cowboys. He and Roscoe Bob had done me a great deal. And I was determined to have my revenge. Mano, como assim, velho? Murderer! 
See, at the time, I was still pretty green and would often blunder into regrettable situations. But I just kept shooting at anything I could see up in those damn rocks. I didn't see Ringo, but I knew he was with the Cowboys. He and Roscoe Bob had done me a dreadful wrong, and I was determined to have my revenge. But to get to Ringo, I knew I'd have to fight my way past these other assholes first. Shoot him! Unfortunately, I was running out of ammo. Another perfect example of my relative inexperience as a hunter of men. I immediately knew that a tactical retreat was called for, as my vengeful fury was much less impressive without the bullets to back it up. Ferrou, mano. Tá acabando a munição. Luckily, serendipity was on my side as I suddenly spotted a way out of my Caraca! Mano, acabou a munição, vi. Tava trocando com os caras, só que a munição acabou. I ran ahead as if the devil himself was after me. Bullets were whizzing by my ears, but I wasn't about to roll over and die. I want you down. Oh, agora tem que fugir mesmo, mano. I just kept running like there was no tomorrow. Because the arma, porra. And his men caught up with me. As I was scurrying around those caves, I thought, what was I thinking, going up against a gang like this? Caralho, não tem arma nenhuma! Pô, eu troquei de arma ali, mano. Não entendi porra nenhuma. Caraca, filhão! Sai, Banzai! They were hunting me like I was game. Mano! Fiquei sem munição, tem que correr igual um viadinho, mano. Not knowing where the hell I was going. Ui! Estou correndo como. Olha, tá bonita essa parte aqui, hein? Porra! O cara continua ainda vindo ainda. Mano, tem um cara chulo. Porra, o cara veio. Caralho, o cara veio de lado, mano. Estranho. Não, Agora sim. And imagine my surprise when I found a fistful of dynamite to go along with that ammo. That stroke of good fortune even the odds and bolstered my confidence. It was time to turn the tables. Time for the prey to become the predator. Time for the hunter to become the hunter. Time. All right, Jesus, we get it. They were right where you wanted. That's right, Jack. I was done running, and the old man's boys were not expecting that. No, sir. I came at them like a wild cat. My fury knew no bounds. Sacanagem, velho. It 
was finally time for that old man to pay for his sins. Pô, tu não pega a bala não, né? Caramba! I yelled out at the top of my lungs. Clinton, I'm coming for you. A little stealth might have made more sense, to be perfectly honest. Because that old fool had a Gatlin gun and enough bullets to last him till kingdom come. But I knew I could not let that deter me. Not if I was to find and kill Ringo. I needed to get that old man off that gun. Como o cara tá me acertando, velho? Para, nossa! Recarrega não essa bosta aí. Tô te vendo, seu otário. Tô chegando, hein. Caraca, muito rápido, mano. Não deu tempo nem de chegar ali, velho. Tá lá em cima. Damn contraption, damn to death. Let me tell you, that was the longest uphill climb of my entire damn life. Well, one of the longest. There was that one time I was pursuing Frank Jesse James. Você tem um, você tem um bracinho já. Jesse James. Perhaps we could talk about that oh, one later. Now where was I? Right. I had old man Clan in my sights. Everyone thought it was the Ruales who had come up against the Guadalupe Canyon, but it was just me. Mano, que ah, mano, dei do tiro na cabeça, apareceu a mensagem, tiro na cabeça e o cara não morreu. 
Ah, que que é isso, velho? Porra, que mentira, velho. Moral, não tinha ninguém ali, mano. A arma tava vazia, cara. Eu olhei pra arma. Atirei na contra-arma, não tinha ninguém. Passei e o cara me acertou com a mesma arma. Ah, mas tá vazia a arma, ó. ó olha lá, ó. Caralho! A arma tá vazia, o cara não é tempo de chegar ali junto comigo e me acertar, mano. Ah, o teu tá arma lá, ó. Acho que eu surpreendi eles, hein? E vai ter ângulo pra virar arma aqui não, hein? Most everyone thought it was the Ruales who had come up against him in Guadalupe Canyon, but it was just me. Vai cair, otário. Ah, é otário. Vai, otarão.
Caralho, que mentira, mano. Tinha um cara ali, onde, cara? Na moral, o cara dropou dali, velho. Não explodiu essas pragas todas. Mano, eu vou esquecer que você é um ancião e eu vou meter bala em você, mano. Tomou, fi. Tomou, filhão. Vai. Vai lá, filhote. Toma, seu otário. Chora. Os caras fizeram isso para eles viverem vivos. E disseram que eu e Billy Clanton que não era um mexicano. Toma, seu otarão. Tá rodei a arma ainda lá. Eles só pensaram que era um dos urbanos. E aquele pequeno misunderstanding... Eventually led to that legendary gunfight at the OK Corral. Recompensa favorita, headshot. Galerinha, vou fechando por aqui. Muito obrigado por ter assistido. Não esqueça de compartilhar o vídeo aí com os amigos aí para ajudar no crescimento do canal. E não esqueça de avaliar o vídeo, beleza? Gostou? Deixa o joinha. Se não gostou, não curtiu. Tá mentindo que assistiu até aqui, então deixa o joinha. Valeu, tamo junto.